this is the craziest signal I have ever seen in Bitcoin. And I have been in Bitcoin now for nearly five years, almost just past four and a half years, actually. Well, if you want to see what I have to share with you in today's video, because I haven't shared a video with you about Bitcoin in the last week, you can see that is because I have been waiting to give you this information based on the dip right now. And if you have not been buying the dip, my friend, I don't know what you have been doing with yourself, but this has been an opportunity of a lifetime. Are we going to see this dip any further? I guess we'll just have to wait and see what will happen as the chart goes on. However, let's get delving into some of the most awesome content I have here from a number of very awesome cryptopreneurs in the space and fellow cryptopians. So if you are ready for that, let me know down in the comments below with a beautiful heart. Let's get going. Thank you for being here with me today. I truly appreciate you being back on Crypto Bliss channel. Today, Bitcoin unfortunately has been bleeding to death. The ribbon has collapsed quite tremendously. It's open quite tremendously too. We've had a UT bot sell signal here and uh, we've had an absolute collapse right down ironically to the bottom of this very interesting horizontal line that I drew here, which is actually the range that I have for you. And that range is very typical between the two orange boxes. And that pretty much looks like an M, right? But actually that also looks like a W perhaps forming just by the way. And generally when W's happen, they can do this and then break up hard like that. Okay, so just to give you some idea on and conceptualization on what is about to happen. Not only that, but the potential of that head and shoulders pattern forming. Okay, this is still higher than that. If you really actually just look so deeply, so close into the chart, you can see there that this is somewhat a little bit higher than that. It still counts, okay, and it's still valid in this trade. Now, the very interesting thing is, and I wanna share this with you. So I've drawn this white box down here for us. And this down sloping channel, this larger time frame here, this was a fake out, by, as you can see here. And we are now down sloping on this trend line. So are we to come down here and consolidate around this between 50 and 53k level well if you've been watching my channel for a few months then you would know that i did tell you something about that and that during this time there would possibly be an absolute meltdown in bitcoin down to this level okay i have been saying it for some time i even said down here towards this level at about 48k now, I'd be very interested to know what your thoughts are, but for now, I'd love to go and see what other people are saying in the space. But before I do that, but before I do that, make sure to subscribe to my channel, of course, if that would be part of your beautiful love towards me. I would appreciate that. Come check out my Bible link down below. I have been absolutely obliterated in these trades. That's okay. I did tell you that that was okay. Why? Because now look at what it is that I've drawn here. I've even drawn a very different pattern, right? Interesting that it's actually, I just noticed this now, an arrow pointing downwards. <laughs> but that's not the signal that I put out there in the thumbnail for you. So yes, my trade was at $200 and it's down 75% essentially. Not a problem, okay? Because right now we have found a very strong bounce off of the bottom of this pattern right here with lower lower lows and actually on the rsi higher lows over there which is bullish divergence right so i just want to share with you that i'm a lot more bullish than i am bearish because if you look at that and you look at that that is bullish divergence we could essentially have been just flushing out all of the 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 very radical position even though mine is 100 leverage that's okay like i told you i'm just doing this to play the piss here with with this money guys this is i mean this is basic money i mean really like just that's what it is and it's okay like as you can see 
six dollars and ten dollars is not a lot of money it's not a lot of money for me and i really hope by you being subscribed to this channel that it's not a lot of money for you either okay because you have been making money with me on the channel but don't do what i do by sitting back in here because i could have bought at multiple entries but that would have raised my buy entry level but don't worry about that because right now this is a great place for us to accumulate some more crypto some more bitcoin in this trade and if it does come down and fall down to this very wonderful 50 to 50k level i did say to you that i would enter another 10 dollars at this current position um, i'm waiting for this chart to come to to look at what it does right now that's all i'm doing i'm just watching very nicely i'm being very patient here and that's just what you should be doing being patient okay because no matter what happens nobody can tell you anything else so hit my bybit link down below you can get up to thirty thousand dollar deposits to go and trade with me trade this beautiful trade with me this is a very good place we're being bought up in this position which for me with strong volume and bullish divergence busy happening this is a very very great trade okay and potentially we could come back up to the 60k 66k level so contra con controversial to what it is that i've said here okay considering that we have hit that level but we are in very strong support on this yellow box so make sure you are with me on my twitter page or my x page because this is only the tip of the bitcoin price you need to study bitcoin actually and know why you should be accumulating it right now and there's not even that much to study guys there's nine pages and bitcoin really is just changing many many people's lives out there in this wonderful beautiful earth so let's tap on to the next one because if you are not i mean I, I love this shout out to vivek every single time bitcoin uh drops down everybody you know people say laugh out loud i ain't buying that shit july 2024 currently while we're busy dropping but you know when it goes back up to 74k i'm an idiot why didn't i buy bitcoin at 57k okay that was in march 2024 so at the end of the day there is so many reasons to be buying bitcoin right now go do your own research your own findings your own homework with that willy woo every day i look at seven squiggly lines to see if it's time nope not yet miners are still bleeding out writhing in pain let's have a silent moment for them <laughs> isn't that quite funny because these seven squiggly lines essentially pull down hard it's not over yet these lines have to cross somewhat to the radical strength position here but really it is what it is and it's about to go up so if you're not ready because the hash ribbons are kind of bottoming out at this point then i'm sorry my friend you're not going to make money in this crypto space you may as well just take your money and exit while it's bleeding out right now i felt the pain and i have a, an article to share with you a little later on but i felt the pain personally when all of my crypto and my old coins have been bleeding and dropping but guess what so has every other diehard crypto investor in the space because we know the value of cryptocurrency and how it will play an incredibly important role in the future for yourself and myself and the entire world okay for business for uh, trade for finance investing documentation legislation government all kinds of things and we can now move on to ali charts bitcoin Closing below 57k could spell some trouble with a potential support only at 51k. That's exactly what I said to you on my chart, right? Okay, down here. That could be the 51k. So if it does go down there, buy the freaking asset. Why would you not? There are only 21 million. And in fact, if you were if you are part of my Twitter page, you'll see that there's not only 21 million left. In fact, Okay, 17.6% of BTC has been lost. And people like yourself and myself, we own 57% of that. So we need to make sure that these areas don't get any more Bitcoin and we're buying as much as Bitcoin so that we can sell it to them at higher prices. Okay, all right. But would you ever sell your Bitcoin? Because I will show you something a little bit later on that proves that you shouldn't sell your Bitcoin. Taking profits, 
possibly selling a Bitcoin don't believe is the right move. Well, let me know what you think down in the comments below. With Ali charts, now looks like most Bitcoin traders have decided to short the corn, creating a liquidation wall at 59,600. Well, guess what? This is where the traders decided to short the corn because there was very little volume, very little strength. And essentially, we were very oversold on the stochastic RSI. We needed to bleed just a little bit more, according to kind of obliterate the shorts because I'll show you why in a moment. Make sure to stay tuned. So with that being said, Bitcoin investors are starting to feel the anxiety as the dip deepens. This is what I've just said to you because I've also been feeling it. And this is the knuckle and it's been bleeding like crazy, but it's bottoming out. OK, and there's optimism in the green. Uh, sorry in the yellow and there's belief in the green and hope is orange capitulation is red but none of that has happened in months so i am confident to say to you that there is belief okay or denial at this current point what do you believe we are currently in right now Seth Bin says that BTC wicked down to 57.8k, liquidated 101,000 traders, open interest flushed by 1 billion US dollars. Boom! Look at that buy candle. Look at this buy candle. Look at this volume that kicked in down there and bought back up. Look at the volume. Look at the freaking awesome, just MACD, crazy, beautiful energy. Well, I'm going to share something else with you now because happy 4th of July. No wonder the market is collapsing because I will show you why in a little moment over the course of the next few slides. So bear with me here because I have still quite a few more articles. But of course, if you are enjoying this, share some love because this takes time to do the research, takes time to find the article, share it with you, do the video, edit it with you. And you, my friend, are here to get educated on crypto. So make some noise in the comments down below. The US government bonds, 10 year yield will do this and Bitcoin and other risk asset, risky assets will love this. Today, 133,000 traders got liquidated for $400 million. The US government bonds covering down a smash. It is unfolding. Okay. Imagine the liquidations that will take place if the US government bonds fall by more than 50 to 60%. Okay. Poof. Now, BTC is overreaching beyond the bull market support like it did in August 2023. The wick has been filled and the weekly RSI is closing in to the same level, likely local bottom around 56 to 57k. Uh, 56 to 57k, that's 56 at the bottom of this end to 57k at the top of this end of my yellow box. So if you have been subscribed to my channel here, you would have known that I've been showing you just very simple, as confusing as my charts look. I've been giving you key areas to look at and this is actually one of them. So you can see here the 200 MA, uh, very, very nicely uh, bounced, but it's overreaching. It's overreaching. When it overreaches, it capitulates. RSI down here, RSI down here. We're getting, like, we're getting to the bottoming point. So BTC orders, books are thick with bids, buy orders full. Boom. All of that happened during the course of the wick up of this candle. This candle came all the way down to 56,801 and it is now currently sitting at 58,162. That's like nearly a 2,000 uh, move to the upside. So boom, whoop, right back up. I don't know about you, but nobody is, uh, nobody is selling their Bitcoin. Well, you and I are not selling our Bitcoin. And if you are, you're selling it at the wrong freaking place because BTC, regular flat pattern, just our opinion. Um, credits to his best friend who you are, Mr. X. Okay, so break up, boom, boom. A move, B move, C move, up. 
da 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 I'm pretty confident I just drew that for you here on my charts a moment ago. Go back and check the beginning of the video because I did. Okay, and I've shown you them for some of the time now. Mickey Bill Crypto, either it bounces off the MA, the 200 MA that is on the daily and support or consolidates below it until the German government selling pressure sub uh, subsidizes. The bottom is well nigh given the daily bullish divergence playing out for the first time ever since September 23. Hidden bullish divergence. I showed you that once again, hidden bullish divergence, the same thing happened there. And then we had this crazy freaking run up all the way from down here. Okay. What was that move? If we are to pull off a move like that, that is a hundred percent from where we are guys. That takes us up to $120,000 Bitcoin, which is essentially my price target. Uh, it's actually up there, but there is my price target at about 103,000 because I think 100,000 will definitely be a psychological level for us to defeat currently at this point. But I think euphoria at that point will kick in and we may have way more investment coming in because euphoria is going to send the price of Bitcoin through the roof. Okay. And because there is such a limited amount and a limited supply and so much like nearly 20% of this, this coin has been lost and it is the coin that governments are buying, institutions are buying, funds are buying, wirehouses are getting ready to buy. Oh, geez, I, I'm buying, you buying. How much Bitcoin can people actually buy if there are only so many? So don't be fooled by where the price is currently because it is going to explode okay and yes it can drop and capitulate drop and capitulate its way up okay if we look at this chart okay and let it drop like it did drop here capitulate start to make its way back up boom and then break its way back up it doesn't have to go through the roof or down down you know it could also typically just sit the freaking sideways and then start to go up once the ethereum etf spot launch has been done and very likely when the u.s elections come about in september very simple but for now bitcoin is down nine percent today liquidating 113 million leverage positions and this is is bitcoin's biggest single daily fall in 320 days yes it is scary as shit but i've been buying i bought myself crazy amounts of bitcoin today and this is where we buy the dip don't be fooled this you need to be strong my friend that is why you are subscribed to the crypto bliss community okay because that is one of the most important places to be on youtube right now on this channel with me because i have been giving you super awesome alpha so if you appreciate that share some love because bitcoiners when price dips just like you and i we go charging to go and buy more bitcoin buy the freaking lows especially the 10 percent days because you don't have very many days where you get dips of 10 percent. so yes michael saylor buys the dips and the bups and the everything ups and downs okay i would agree with that strategy because over time your accumulation of bitcoin's value will just absolutely massively increase with the way that the world's liquidity will come into bitcoin and we are the warriors right ahead of this journey as you can see holding a 57 percent of bitcoin as individuals align so isn't that pretty fun, right? Now, you can see here, it was a 9% candle. There was a 9% candle, then we ran sideways, didn't even break the low much, and then carried on upwards, as I said, for the 100% move. Here, this one was a 10% down, and then a bump up. And then here, it was probably also a 10% down, and then freaking bump up. So, I don't know where you believe, and you can see here, boom, uh, well, actually, boom, 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 and boom, 
we have had major massive days but on the major massive days the following days there is always a buying up of the coin okay sell hard buy sell hard buy sell hard buy sell hard buy mega so <laughs> if you're selling bitcoin right now good luck absolutely good luck you should be buying because just in Germany lists a new Bitcoin macro ETP electronic traded perpetual on the Deutsche Börse. Okay, this is the German stock exchange if for those of you if you don't actually know what that is, the Deutsche Börse. But as I said, elections will create the massive pump because Donald Trump, the Bitcoin king and advocate right now running this presidential campaign his name sparks talks of a bitcoin as a strategic reserve asset because if we already didn't know this and i'm sure if you've been in crypto for a long time now every nation will recognize bitcoin as a strategic reserve asset some will be first well who do you think will be first because there are already a couple out there Bitcoin, titan of crypto, Bitcoin on the uh, last capitulation before the run up, Bitcoin has confirmed the breakout of the 10 can on the weekly. So the 10 can is the red line, okay? The next support is the Kindred at around 56,100. I'm pretty confident I really showed you we hit 56,800. So that was the bottom. And okay, because that is a very strong buy signal there at the moment. But we haven't had this yet because we have not yet got it. Well, the RSI, the Stochastic, the MACD, and the PMO of very, very, and the um, ribbon are very, very overheated. We're about to get an absolute certain retracement. Well, from that level, 50, 56,754, we should at least see another 6% up to the upside. So I don't know about you, but it's a pretty decent trade if you did get in at the bottom, but just buy more. Just keep buying more on spot. I bought more on spot at that level, so my spot is up already. And that's what I mean. Just buy more crypto at the dips. Now, Deutsche Telekom. Isn't everything happening in Germany? It's quite interesting. Hey, cannabis legalization, um, uh, crypto legalization. The Germans are, are very intelligent nations. Just remember, they made Mercedes, which are some of the best selling cars in the world. BMW is the same thing. Lamb, uh, uh, Ferrari. Uh, uh, Porsche, excuse me, and a number of others. So, Deutsche Telekom joins Subsquid Decentralized Network. So, Deutsche Telekom's latest partnership with Subsquid follows its recent announcement to expand into Bitcoin mining at the BTC Prague conference. So, cool. Bitcoin miners are selling some of their Bitcoin. Well, cool they needed to capitulate a little bit right because they had to get rid of their old tech to get new tech to mine the new level of heart at harvey of bitcoin okay so that's just what it is and that's going to be the same every single four years it's what it is now we are almost at minus 3.0 in the volatility adjusted power law index in other words what this means that anything under the zero is an absolute steal of a price for bitcoin right now we are nowhere near the the sequence to overheat it in the cycle and you need to be very conscious about that right now because at at the previous uh halving at the previous heart or cycles look at the bottom boom look at the bottom boom look at the bottom okay our bottom is only here all of these bottoms were down here we are about to get this blowing out of this chart i'm very surprised we can see what's going to happen remember look at how high we still have to go we are almost at three points down. You need to be accumulating crypto. 
without that being financial advice, mags the scalping pro bitcoin broke down below the range low important support is below us i'm pretty confident i just showed you that on the daily time frame on this chart and i showed you that down here could be the next support level down sloping trend like i said to you oh so many things that could happen here break out pull up okay critical support must hold so essentially we need to get ourselves right back up above that that level and reclaim that level back up here at about 61k so that is going to be important for us to see over the next few days but if we don't do that there is a very strong possibility we could get the much uh needed support down here at 50 to 52k and the reason why that is is i want to show you just very much so how strong of support that is at this point over here which is where a lot of activity took place in that zone so there is a reason for everything don't be scared don't be fooled just carry on buying the dip because even though bitcoin is currently testing the 200 ma support for the third time boom 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 well actually that's four times well that's breakout retest test test and test look at what it did here it was a fake out and then a massive rally fake out and then a massive rally then we kind of retest the 200 support once again why would we not it just is what it is so this is like 200 days of breakout movement here how beautiful is it to see the charts like this shout out to you uh sculping pro i absolutely love it and and it really just very very excited so bitcoin is about to pump hard macd is about to cross the bullish for the seventh time since the 15,500 level. Buy, 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 buy. And now we are possibly getting into that buy zone because we're crossing. And each time the MACD has turned bullish, we have witnessed a significant uh, jump in Bitcoin's price. Are you actually freaking ready? If you are, make some noise in the video for me and everybody's content here on this uh, that I'm sharing with you on this channel because the buy equal the bottom, 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 bottom. And could we be getting a bottom now, even though we broke down crazily today on this chart? So, last couple charts Tony the Bull BTC, the two month slow stochastic percentage daily has percentage has reached overbought levels. Boom. Is this concerning? Do you think it's concerning? In the past, this happened just prior to the largest part of the bull run in Bitcoin. Is this different this time? I don't believe so. If you look at this point, okay, we're at this current point. There was a, let's just call it a tabletop, a resistance level right now. Boom, boom, boom. Halving point, overbought. Boom. We had months of rally. Then the same thing happened. Resistance level, tabletop. Halving date, pop boom we're at the same point here right now we are about to see a massive boom 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 i'm pretty confident and another one from tony the two month bitcoin chart has perfected a td9 sell setup hmm. are you selling though with everything that i have just showed you because the only time this has happened, this happened previously, BTC actually did almost a 20x in the following months. With the same setup that triggered here in 2017, uh, will we see another historic bull run? Because the same thing is currently happening right now at this point. Two green dots, are we ready to get pumped? Two green dots, are we ready to get pumped? And are we gonna see prices i mean if we had to draw this this zone up here when that actually happened would we see a million dollar bitcoin what do you think let me know down in the comments below and i want to share one last couple last couple of charts with you because right now uh -huh, 2033 2233 right now 12 billion dollars worth of bitcoin shorts to be liquidated at seventy thousand dollars so if you think that right now, okay, there are going to be no buys, we are going to see some very hectic stuff because people are shorting Bitcoin right now because they believe it's continuing to fall 
But I've just proven to you and I've showed you that there is a possibility that we should bounce from this current level. Now, ha, rumors that Trump will adopt Bitcoin as a reserve asset for the USA is absolutely huge. We are about to go parabolic because buying one BTC in 2035 will be like this. That will be absolutely ridiculous. And how can I say that to you? Well, I think I have shown you this tremendous amounts of time. All of our indicators here are telling us that this is about to go up. And this is the US M2 money supply and the US are about or, or currently are increasing the money supply already. They already have been increasing the money supply. It's bouncing so nicely off of this ribbon with a very strong buy signal that took place at the end of March 2024. So for you, for me, I would be very, very optimistic about just accumulate as much as you can right now because the demise of the dollar is unfolding. And I'd love to just leave you lastly with this funny freaking video right here from North Korean leader Kim Jong, who uh, Kim Jong urges citizens to buy the Bitcoin dip in an emotional speech. Let's have a look at this video. Which one's the best crypto asset? Well, Bitcoin's the best crypto asset. Okay. What's the second best? There is no second best. There's no second best crypto asset. There's a crypto asset. It's called Bitcoin, right? Right? There's no second best, okay? But take all your money, buy Bitcoin. Then take all your time, figure out how to borrow more money to buy more Bitcoin. Then take all your time and figure out what you can sell to buy Bitcoin. And if you absolutely love the thing that you're that you don't want to sell it, go mortgage your house and buy Bitcoin with it. And if you've got a business that you love because your family works for the business that's in your family for 37 years, and you can't bear to sell it, mortgage it, finance it, and convert the proceeds into the hardest money on earth, which is Bitcoin. <laughs> I think that was hilarious. Let me know what you think about that down in the comments below. Please make sure you're subscribed to my channel. Use my Bybit link to get into this trade here with me. Let's go make some money together. Thank you very much for being here. I truly appreciate you. And we will see you on the next one, you blessed soul. Take care. Have a good evening.